In this log, we would like to create an animation in Rive dashboard and try to implement that particular animation in our Flutter application. So, in the previous tutorial, we have covered the implementation of Rive animation and also have seen this particular animation for vehicle here. And this has been directly populated from this particular URL through Rive animation dot network here. But in this part of the tutorial, let us try to create or customize an animation and try to download that particular animation and implement that in the same code which we have created in our previous vlog. And before getting started, I suggest you to watch the previous tutorial on Rive animation if you have not watched that particular tutorial. And also, we have covered the Lottie based animations in Flutter application. So, if you are interested, I will be providing the link in the description section below. So you may have a look at it. So now let's get started with the animation. So this is the Rive website here and this is the official website for animations and you can get started here. And when we tap on get started here, you can find the animation as well on the websites. As we discussed in the previous vlog, we can create animation for mobile apps and websites and any software application which we create. Okay, so let's get started here. And I have already signed up with my Gmail account. So I was being taken directly into the dashboard here. And I'm just working on this particular rating animation. And I will show you how this particular rating animation works. And if you are not having any particular animation on this particular dashboard, just tap on the plus button over here. And here you can find these animations. And if you are interested in creating your own animation, you can just select the blank artboard here and tap create here and get started with your animation. So I will quickly open this particular rating animation here. So here this is a dashboard where you can get started with the animation. And here we have picked up the existing animation that is the rating animation over here. And we are trying to find how this particular animation is being created. And also we can just customize these animations a bit and try downloading them onto our Flutter application. So here this is the hierarchy if you find here and the assets used in this particular animation. So here as we are making use of an existing animations. We have not added any of these assets which are displayed over here. And let's get back to the hierarchy here. And here you can find all the stars like star 5 and star 4. And here if you observe star 5 is having two options that is sparks and glow here. So whenever the star 5 is being visible. So they have added some special effects like a sparks when compared to the star 4 here because star 5 means it's like an highest rating which we get. So whenever we provide this particular rating for any product or service or anything where you want to show like a 5 rating then whenever the 5 rating is being displayed so it, it's a bit special. So it has some sparks appearing in this particular star 5 here and for the star 4 just a glow it will appear. And the remaining three stars, there is no, I mean, any special animation, just the star gets filled with white color. So, here let's try to observe the same now. And here is our now, let's try to move from left to right and observe the animations. And let's try to expand this panel up a bit here and try to observe this particular star. So, this is a zero second, and in the zero second, there is no animation currently. And in the first second, you can observe like the first star is being filled. And in the second second, the second star as well as third and fourth star here. And here you can observe the glow over there. So there is a bit glow on the border of this particular star. And when it comes to the fifth star here, you have got the color filling like white color is filled. And then there is a spark coming up and also a glow over there. So here you can clearly observe the steps over here. So here just try to observe whenever the fifth star is being pointed. So it, it got filled first and then the sparks. So this is the sparks which is being loaded and then our glow came in again. So here you can find after the sparks itself the glow came up. 
so this is how the animation is been designed and also you can add your own customizations the star animation looks good because for the fifth star they have added some special glow and sparks kind of thing a combination of glow and sparks but i suggest you to create an animation based on your application logo like your company logo and try to add these type of animations over there and it will also highlight your company logo brand and also will get a good look on your application startup that is in a splash screen as well so now let's try to find the colors used over here so in the design aspect so till now we have seen the animate here and now in the design tab here we have got the colors over here now so here in the design part whenever you tap on a particular element here you can find here we have tapped on the stars now so the colors regarding to the stars are being displayed and when you want to remove this particular pink background and want to have a totally different color you can just try to select same from here so instead of a pink color i just want something to be like a pink and a blue so a combination like a gradient color and now let's try to okay make use of this and here for the filling here for the stars you can also just adjust them not completely white a bit white and black so in the blend of both black and white here and also you can find the small stars inside this so these are nothing but the glow which appears when the particular star is being highlighted and also if required you can just change the glow color as well and here this is the filling which we are trying to change now and white color only uh, i think best suited for the filling so i just don't want to change the filling and all the inside colors so this looks perfect for me and now it's time for downloading the animation here and here you have got the options like share publish and download but share and publish are mostly for the pro users and the best option here we are having for a test account is like a download option here so just try it. i'm tapping on this particular download button and here i'm pasting this particular animation so previously i have got a rating animation so so i have removed that particular rating animation and trying to add the new animation file now so so the assets and animation directory structure i have explained in this part of the tutorial so i suggest you to watch this particular tutorial and find how i have made this particular directory structure and also now let's try to remove this particular url and also the drive animation dot network let's make it asset over here and now let us try to specify the path for this particular asset so assets forward slash animations so this is the folder name and forward slash rating underscore animation dot riv so riv is the extension here and also make sure just as i have specified in the previous tutorial as well so the animation should be followed by dot riv extension only because that is what is being supported by this particular plugin here because we are making use of live animation here so dot riv is only the supported so anywhere like if you are using the url also or the local file so this is the same format which you need to make use of so now our application is been up and running and here this is like box fit dot cover again so i just don't want it to be cover let's make it a fill here and try to save the code and open the simulator again okay so it's not properly fit onto the screen and this is how our animation works which we have created in the live dashboard so we have just changed the background color and the rest animation is the same which we got from the existing one and this is it for this particular tutorial on live animation so we have got a complete of four tutorials based on the flutter animations so i hope you find these tutorials interesting and if you are having any queries just let me know in the comment section below and the code for this tutorial is being provided in the description section below so if you like this tutorial do like share and subscribe to our channel for more interesting content on flutter